Stories of the Bible. Hello, Super Gang. Now, Bunny and I thought it would be lovely to listen to a story about Easter together from a storybook. Now, we know that there's a very sad bit in the Easter story where Jesus died, but there's lots of wonderful things that happened afterwards. And I thought we could look at the story together. The story is the Easter Bible storybook. Jesus died and his body was put in a cave with a stone in front. Mary and her friends went to the cave. The stone had moved. The cave was empty. Then two angels appeared. They said, Jesus is not here. Jesus isn't dead. He's alive. Mary and her friends were amazed and very happy. They ran to tell Jesus' friends the good news. Jesus is alive. Peter and John, who were Jesus' friends, went to the cave. The cave was empty. Where was Jesus? Was he really alive? Mary met Jesus in the garden. Jesus was alive. Two friends met Jesus on the road. Jesus was alive. Friends met Jesus at dinner time. Jesus was alive. Peter met Jesus when he was fishing. Jesus was alive. Jesus' friends told everyone, Jesus is alive. What a great story that was, Bunny, reminding us that even though the star of the story at Easter can be a little bit sad, Jesus is alive and so Easter is really good news. Now I have got a little craft that you might like to make. And I'm going to show you how to make it now. You'll need some paint and a piece of paper and a heart that someone's cut out for you. Press the heart down onto the piece of paper and then use your finger like a paintbrush and dab different colours of paint all over your paper. You can go over the edges of the heart too. Once you've finished putting all of the paint on that you want to, you can peel the heart off and you'll be able to see a beautiful picture full of colours just like the flowers in spring and a beautiful heart in the middle to show us that it is Jesus that gives us new life. Jesus who's alive loves us. Happy Easter!